everyone. Welcome back to another Daily Energy Draw. This is going to be for Tuesday, June 18th, 2019. Today we're going to be using the Energy Oracle Cards. And remember, these videos are meant to be timeless, so no matter when you are watching them, take the messages as they resonate with you. Even though they are time-stamped, um, look at the titles and see what comes out for you. All right, so Spirit, let's get a message for, oh, Spirit wants to talk. Let's get a message for Tuesday, June 18th, 2019. What do we need to know for Tuesday, June 18th, 2019? Tuesday, June 18th, 2019. How did you guys do on the uh, full moon? Let me know in the comments how you guys fared. We might still be feeling some of the energies here. Okay. Just want one card. Just one card, please. I'm going to give these another shuffle. And I'm going to try to get one card for Tuesday, June 18th, 2019. We have Journey. Give me a second. Um, there's a lot that's coming in for this. The first thing, okay, the first thing that they're pointing out is journey as a whole. This journey as a whole, the ascension journey as a whole, especially the divine counterparts, divine partnership journey as a whole, because they're pointing me to the number two card on here. Um, you see how there are all these signs, um, the bridge. Okay, there's a lot of symbolism that's coming in. They're giving me a lot of messages. Slow down. Okay, so what they're saying is this journey, you see that bridge and how it's it's kind of like it's a wooden bridge. It looks kind of um, unsturdy. Um, there's only one railing. There's stuff hanging off of it, um, but there are signs that are still guiding. This is the symbol of this journey. It seems precarious sometimes. It seems difficult sometimes. It seems like, how can I go on sometimes? But the science, the synchronicities, the universe itself is guiding you along. And here you are being a guide for others. Now, take it as it resonates for you, divine masculine or divine feminine. They're not, give, they're not distinguishing here. This is the energy of oneness. This is the energy of divine partners coming together into union, now guiding, now guiding those behind you those of you who are on your path behind you. So this is definitely an energy of those of you who are in the segment, uh, who are coming into union, who are in the process of union, or who are in union. Um, this is divine masculine and divine feminine energy. Again, they are not distinguishing between the two um, because it's an energy of oneness. It's an energy of unity. So this is you, both of you, divine masculine and divine feminine on this journey. You are leading the way. You are the bright light for others. Now, see how she is, all that baggage is left behind this is what you're doing on this journey. You are leaving all that soul sludge, as I like to call it, behind. You are leaving all the baggage behind. It's not needed anymore. You have a fresh start. The past is not needed. And it's no coincidence that we just had a full moon because full moon is all about letting go. Full moon is all about release. It's all about closing out of a cycle, a lunar cycle. Um, but especially for these divine partners, especially for those of you who are on this ascension journey, especially for the segment that I typically um, channel for and the segment that I'm channeling for now, you are at a stage in your evolution where you have closed out the karmic cycles. You might There might be some residual, like residue from that, um, but you've closed out the karmic cycles and now it is the next stage. Now it is time for you to level up. Are you going to level up? Are you going to leave the baggage behind? Are you going to leave the past behind? Are you ready to step forward and be the light, be the guiding light for others? The future is unknown. All you have to guide you are these signs from the universe. You see how there are signs going in every which direction? This is the universe saying, trust me. Trust me. Trust that I am guiding you just as you are guiding others. Trust this journey. Trust yourself because we're working in tandem with the universe. So as you trust your heart and as you trust your soul and your own intuition, that is the universe guiding you as well because you're co-creating with the universe. You're working in tandem with the universe, side by side with the universe. So go forward fearlessly, fearlessly, and shine your light for those who are still awakening, those who are 
following your light, shine that light, and move forward into your future, this next phase of your evolution, leaving all that toxicity behind you, all that karma behind you. It's not needed in this next phase of your life. It's just not needed because all there is is, you see the light here? That's the universe saying, I've got you. I've got you. This is the light of my love, the source is saying, the universe is saying. This is the light of my love. And just let that love guide you. And as this light guides you, you're going to be opening up to more and more love, and you're going to be the light for others. It's, it's such a beautiful energy. As you follow the light of love, you open up to your love. That love just expands, and you then become the light for others. Beautiful. It's just beautiful energy. That's this journey. That's this journey. And the two again, divine partners. Divine partners. Just beautiful. All right, you guys, we'll be back tomorrow with another daily energy draw. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe, and stay tuned for the regular readings. I will see you guys soon. Send you guys so much love and so much light.